from Delhi to Karnataka. Income tax raids against Mantri D.K. Shivkumar continued to day two. So far, 8.3 crores in cash have been recovered from the national capital, 2.5 crores from Bengaluru. Inside details accessed by Times Now, nail offshore links as well, and a hoard of Benami properties linked with the Congress Mantri. So those details are now out uh, in public domain. We have exposed the kind of recoveries that have been made in cash and uh, also in jewelry. We have also spoken about the Benami property documents that have been seized. Shireen has more details on the recoveries. Uh, Shireen, uh, I believe the raids have concluded. Uh, give us a breakup of the kind of recoveries that have been made from various locations. Uh, in so far as over 50 locations belonging to DK Shivkumar being raided. Well, talking about the Delhi residence of DK Shivkumar, uh, uh, around 8.33 crore have been recovered from here. Yesterday, around 7.5 crore was recovered, and today, the rest, the remaining of the cash has been recovered. Not just the cash, but also some crucial documents have also been recovered from this particular house, uh, which actually shows that he had got uh, kicked back from some uh, elect uh, electric companies and also uh, how. How he has investment in offshore, uh, has done offshore investments and also uh, documents related to Benami uh, property. So these are some of the crucial documents that has been accessed by the IT officials. What we have been told is that the raid has come to a conclusion, but even now there are officials who are writing down what all they have recovered so that they can pass on to their other uh, colleagues and also coordinate with them because our, the sources are also telling us that they might pass this report to other agency as well to investigate into other um, uh, cases related to D.K. Shivkumar because uh, this time the, uh, the tainted uh, Minister D.K. Shivkumar who is the Energy Minister of Karnataka has clearly come under the radar and uh, he has been under the scanner of IT uh, department for, for long but now it seems that uh, the IT department has now proofs and evidences to show. Now the Congress, the onus lies on the Congress party and on D.K. Shivkumar to come out clean because they have been defending D.K. Shivkumar right. throughout because he is not just close to the Chief Minister of Karnataka but also to the High Command.